Look, I have a confession to make. For the last few months, honestly, I haven't really been trying. In fact, I would go as far as to say for the entire last six months, I've played the game so little that I don't think I've improved a single mechanic since 2022. You know, I could make excuses. I could sit here and say, you know, I've been busy making YouTube videos or running the coaching program or anything else. But for whatever reason, the fact remains, I'm still not SSL. And I want to give the SSL push one last shot. So today we are officially resuming the solo to SSL in rank twos to see number one, if I can actually get up to SSL, but maybe more importantly, number two to actually document the journey for you guys and hopefully help you learn and rank up with me. So without any further intro, welcome back to the road to SSL. By the way, if you're new here and you don't know me, I'm a peak GC3 coach, but I run Rocket League's number one live coaching program called the Grand Champ Roadmap, where we take plat through champ ranked players up to GC in just six weeks flat. At the time I'm recording this, we just hired two new coaches to help catch up with demand for the program. Point is, we've now got 40 seats restocked. So if you want to get that GC title and join the now over 2,500 players inside, DM me with the keyword 12 on Discord and we can talk details about coaching. My Discord will be first linked down below. Otherwise, enjoy the games. For game one, we got Goth on our team and we're up against Vister and Ben Carnacion. Brilliant. We're going to cheat up, as always. Ball's going to come back to left here. I'm just going to take this to the corner, and I want to buy time for my teammate, because my teammate just came from kickoff, right? So no need to rush. I'm going to let him overcommit in my corner, get a good 50-50, and now we have a 2v1 if we move up the field quickly, right? No need to rush. Corners are safe places. You want the ball in your corner. It's not a bad thing. He's going to clear the ball. I'm going to wait till my teammate rotates behind. Now that my teammate's rotated behind, I can hit it up. And I can maybe just try to hit it high and awkward. I don't have much boost, so that's going to be the best I can do. Grab side boost and just try to get behind my teammate as best as possible. Looks like he's got it. He'll clear it to the corner. I can follow it up potentially. Hit it off the sidewall. Get one touch up. And then maybe tip it by him. Not quite. Unfortunately, teammate gets demoed. So I'm going to stay up here. Just because my teammate got demoed, I can maybe keep applying pressure. Just be a nuisance, right? I'm not going to create a goal here. I'm not trying to commit too hard. Just be a nuisance. I could buy time. Ball's going to come to the side here. They're double committed on their team, but it's kind of awkward, so I can't push up yet. I got to wait back. And because I waited back there and my teammate wanted to cut in, we should be able to get a goal. Oh, I totally missed the... I don't know if it was an open, but I probably should have scored that. He's going to boom the ball right to me, so I'm going to try to control it down for my teammate. And we'll just reset. Let the teammate work. They're just going to boom the ball away. See, this is the problem with champs. People at this rank just boom, 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 boom. They don't they don't control the ball on any part of the field, ever. And keeping the ball close is so important. Here, I'm just going to be looking for a demo because he's in an awkward spot. And now we can rotate behind. Teammate's going to get a 50-50. Looks like he has it. So I'm just going to go back. Keep letting them toss ball until I can get saves. Now ball's on the wall. I'm going to check using my camera to see if he's there. And then maybe I can hit it center. Teammate can maybe get a follow-up. Not quite. That's fine. I'm just going to wait back. My teammate's in front of me. I can't commit while he's up. Still can't commit. They're going to keep going. Still can't commit. Finally, they all challenge. Now I can go. Maybe get a cut. And a simple pop will lead to a goal. And the key there is just waiting. Like, if people want to keep flying up and challenging the ball, eventually they will miss. Especially, like, when they're challenging plays they shouldn't. So, I'll lead to a goal. 1-0. I'm going to be speed flipping, but my goal is not to just, like, dominate kickoffs and, you know, score off them. I feel like speed flips are fair to use at champ. This ball is going to go into the corner. Once again, notice my teammate is challenged. So I'm just going to try to buy time here. My teammate is committed. So I'm just going to wait back. Try to control the ball for him. My teammate should be able to grab corner boost. Let him do his thing. I'm going to wait center. He doesn't look like he has control. So I, I just kind of got to wait back here. Just in case he loses. Once again, he does lose. So what am I going to do? I'm going to hit it to my corner and buy time. Let him rotate back. And eventually, we can finally challenge the ball. This is center of the field, so I'm going to boom it away. Yes, my teammate's going, but because it was center of the field, that's why I'm intercepting the ball there. Not the best play to double commit, but, you know, it's fine. Going to go back for corner boost. My teammate looks like he has the ball. He's going to rip a shot from midfield. Not the best shot, but that's fine. This guy's going to hit the ball into my corner here. I just kind of got a guard shot. Notice how I'm hitting it with my wheels there, so it doesn't recenter super fast. Small thing, but... Helps the no air roll. And now I'm just going to try to wait on my back post. Nice. He hits it into my corner. Turn off ball cam. Try to control the ball up the sidewall. Careful of demo. Teammate should have this totally fine. Let him control it. Let him grab side boost. 
Okay, so if you're my team... This is my bad. I should be back post. I should expect my teammate to get dunked. However, if you are my teammate in these scenarios, you want to take this ball ideally to the side boost. You don't want to try to push the ball through the middle of the field. Because when you push the ball through the middle of the field, that's when you get dunked like that. So we kind of want to take that ball out of, off the side wall, but it's fine. I should have been ready. Ball will 50 up, so I'm just going to hit it to my corner, grab boost, and then cover shot. It's fine. We're able to cover the angle. Now we can push up a little bit. My teammate has control. It looks like... Oh, he almost had that. If he just slows down there, we can score. But that's fine. We're going to wait center. He seems awkward, so just keep delaying for him. Hit the ball high. Teammate gets demoed. It's going to come off the wall here, so I can beat this guy that's first. And then maybe just look for a demo here as I rotate through. Create an opportunity for my teammate. Once again, he's going to hit into the corner. Control the corner boost and just get behind the ball. If they want to keep booming it, let him keep booming it. Like, none of these touches are good for orange. So just wait. Stay behind my team. I hear that guy trying to demo me, so I just hit the brakes. And then he goes flying by me. Let my teammate go. If he wants to air dribble, fine. We kind of just got to wait back here. There's no productive play. I just have to buy time for my teammate to get back now, now that he's overcommitted. I'm going to hit this high. That just makes it at least awkward for them. Makes it hard for Ben to get an easy follow-up. And now we have a 2v1 temporarily. So I want to hit this ball up the field quick if I can. Unfortunately, a slightly heavy first touch. So we're gonna, my teammate's going to get it back. Once again, my teammate just booms it away. Not ideal, but it is what it is. We're going to get demoed. That's unfortunate. And this could be a goal. Nope. Luckily, they missed the opens. So we're going to get away. We should have got scored on there. Totally. But that's fine. Mistakes all around. Just going to wait back here for center. He spikes it way too high. He looks like he still has follow-up, though, so we kind of got to wait back. Just control boost here. He has no boost, so I just need to keep controlling boost. Just be ready for when a center does come. Once again, he gets my boost, but this is fine. There's no play here from him. So I can just hit the ball forward, make it super awkward on these guys. They're low boost. We have a lot of pressure. If we can keep pressure going, we could probably break through and score here. I want to go, but can't go until my teammate leaves. Once my teammate leaves, I'll go here, but if he keeps driving for it, I kind of just have to wait back. Now we're in a tough spot. Oh, I just have to try to cover as much net as possible. This is unfortunate. I'm going to say I'm going to 50-50 the kickoff and try to kill it. Oh, unfortunate. Maybe my teammate can get it. Potentially. Oh, we probably would have got a goal there. <laughs> but first game is going to be lost, and I think that's honestly fair. Like, we deserve to lose that one. So I could have played much better. All right, let's jump into game two. We're against Goth again, but now we got NZP, so it's a different story. We'll go for this kickoff. I'll be a little more mechanical this game. I'm gonna grab half boost. He's just gonna rip a shot from half field again. Again, I don't know why champs love to rip shots from half field when they could dribble the ball closer. I will never know. Team, it has. We have a two v one here. To make it's a nice fifty. I want to go for this, but it looks like he has it, so I'm just gonna be patient. Keep letting them hit the ball. Nice shot from him, but it's not gonna lead to anything. Unfortunately, my teammate double commits. But this guy is still pushing up, and that's just a mistake from him. That second, that last man back just should not have gone there. We should have been punished there, because my teammate shouldn't have, should have ideally seen me saving the ball. But, you know, it works. Leads to a goal. We'll let NZP go and cheat up for the ball. Cheat up here. Ball's going to come high. and can go for a shot straight away, just because he's not cheating. And, like, guys, if you're watching right now and you're in champ, stop going for corner boost on kickoffs. This is why. If there's ever a 50-50 like this, whoever gets the ball just gets a free goal. That's all right. Ball's going to come center here. I'm just going to try to get one soft touch and go for a shot. I don't know why he didn't save that ball. That was not an impressive shot. I'm going to say thanks, but that was not a good shot. I mean, I had zero boost. This is not a heater. All right, cheat up. I feel like that one was not earned. Teammate gets a decent kickoff. I'm going to try to grab boost. Can't quite grab it, so I'm just going to stay here and be a presence. I'm not actually committing for the ball. I'm just forcing them to hit it. Teammate gets a nice save to the corner. I'm just going to grab a bunch of small pads here and stay in net. That's going to make it nice and easy for us. Teammate wants to go. Turn around, grab this boost. Easy. He's going to boom it into my corner. Great. So I can just get back post, and now I have an easy time hitting the ball at the field, and it's a 2v1. So I want to go for a power slide cut, and he, where is this man going? I, I don't even know what to they're, 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 We got to talk about second man defense. Champs, take notes. Yes, I hit the ball on an angle. I mean, the key, the key to that play is just making your first touch on an angle. It makes the whole thing easier after that. But, folks, that is not that special. We can't. I feel like I'm bullying these guys. I'm not even doing anything special. Oh, all right. He's fine. Hits it into the corner. All right. Take all the boost. We cool? I'll just chill. And Goth IRL is now throwing. Welcome to champ, folks. <laughs> 
<laughs> controller break? <laughs> Let's see. Are we back? We're back. He's going to get a dunk. All right. Ball goes into the corner. I'm going to grab corner boost. Just way back here. My teammate looks like he has control, so I'm going to move up. Now it looks like he's about to lose it, so I gotta kind of got to get back. Keep letting them follow up. Just cover net. Nice. He hits it away. I'll be able to hit it off the wall. Follow up the ball. Don't actually get a touch there, but somehow it works. And Goth own goals. Oh, ball's coming back to me. All right, here we go. Double tap. Here it comes. Clip it. Come on. All right. Cut to the next one. Jumping into game three, we got... Uh, <laughs> Uh, amazing. We have teammate against Sonic and Yawner. Let's sick him. Ball's going to go to the corner. I need to rotate back and control corner boost as best as possible. This guy is overcommitted, so I want to turn onto the offensive as quick as possible. Force a 50-50. Let's move up the field as quick as we can while we have a 2v1. Ball's going to come center here. My teammate fakes for me. Amazing fake, teammate. They're going to get a nice save. Can I turn here? Nope. So I'm going to have to half flip back. He overcommits by flipping, so I can hit it high. And they seem really awkward here. They're low boost, so I'm going to stay up and pressure just because I know how awkward he is. Teammate, unfortunately, overcommits, so we're going to have to get back for him. Maybe power slide cut around one. We do get a power slide cut, but if I just outspeed them there, I feel like that's not that's not game sense. So we'll, we'll chill for a second. This guy, they, they keep flipping on the ground, so it's making it very easy for me to know when to challenge. This guy has no flip, so just hit it to the corner. Let my teammate go. That guy's going to grab my corner boost. That's fine, so I'm going to have to play off pads. My teammate doesn't grab our corner boost for some reason, which is interesting. He's now taking the ball through the midfield, and yeah, he gets demoed. That makes sense. That's that's kind of what happens when you do that. Um, All right, so I'm going to toss away possession, but at least I can grab boost and maybe rotate out and get a demo. Stay behind my teammate here. Let my teammate hit He's going to hit it off to the left side. That's going to get to me almost. Try to turn there. My teammate looks like he has it, so I'm going to wait back for him. Just going to try to keep covering net. Hit it off to my teammate. Maybe he can get a 1v1. And no, he just booms ball away. That, you know, that's what we do. We're in champ. Of course. Boom ball. Just keep booming the ball, guys. Everybody, just hit it away. Keep hitting it away. Oh, my. I've been bumped. That was almost bad. But, all right. He's taking the ball out through the midfield again. Very suspicious. This guy's taking the ball into our corner. I feel like people at this rank don't know whether they're playing offense or defense. Maybe that's the real problem here. We aren't able to get a demo following through on that guy. That's unfortunate. Maybe my teammate can save. If not, we'll hit him with the my bad. I should have scored my one-on-one, -on -one, right? If I don't convert my one-on-one -on -one and then my teammate gets scored on, it's my fault. All right, we'll cheat up. Ball's going to come center. I'm going to grab corner boost because I was the one cheating, so that's fine. But now I know my teammate's behind me, so I have to be slow with this attack. I can't go super fast because he's got he needs time to grab boost and do his thing. I'm going to play middle here and just be an outlet for him. He does get dunked, so I'm going to have to jump up here and just hit this into the corner, kill it at least for the time being. My teammate looks awkward, so I'm going to go early. Maybe my teammate can follow this up. I think he's low on boost. I don't know why he didn't go. Nice try on the shot. I can maybe keep this in with a half flip and then follow it up with an air dribble here or something. Almost get a goal. Can get a little more mechanical there, but probably shouldn't. Teammate misses the open. Normal. And now we're kind of in an awkward spot. I should have stayed up there. That's my mistake. Yeah, I'm just going to get back. I'm just going to get out here, turn back on ball cam, and wait. Nice cut by him. It's going to be wide, though. I just got to watch the center. That's going to be fine. And we have a 2v1 here. He's just going to keep booming it. This doesn't do really do anything for them as long as my teammate doesn't panic, gets corner boost. Should be okay. My teammate looks like he has it, but I am scared of him coughing ball here. Nice. Blue team just hits it to me. Uh, I want to keep going, but I am low on boost, so I need to kind of get back post here and get behind my teammate in case he gets beat. Teammate looks like he has control. Nice half flip. Nice control. This is looking good for a champ lobby, so we'll wait here. Fortunately, he does get stopped. I'm going to hit it around one. Maybe pop it over or get a demo on the other. And that does leave an open for my teammate. Uh, it was hard. Okay. It's fine. Well, it's kind of hard for my teammate, so I get if you can't get that. So we, we stay down 1-0. Did he score the open? Yes. Hit him with a nice shot. Come on. And now we're even. All right. Game is back in our control. I should not have said that, should I? Okay, we're fine. 
temporarily. Teammate misses boost, so this is going to be a little dangerous. I'm going to need to wait here center. He doesn't do the best job on his end, so I'm just going to keep rotating through, grab corner boost. Maybe I can turn early here. I'm just trying to force for my teammate. Give my teammate an easy ball to go for, right? And make it clear to him that I'm leaving when I'm leaving. I want to go, but my teammate's still up, so I'm just going to chill. I want to go for this ball, but I can't quite go until my teammate is behind me. Or at least I don't like to. You know, I can. Here, I'm just trying to create space for my teammate to go, but it's fine. I, I understand it's awkward for him. If we have comms there, then we probably get a freebie, but that's fine. Teammate gets a 50. He looks like he's still got the ball, so I'm just going to wait back. Teammate's intercepting, so I just got to let him go. Can't go until my teammate's done. Here, I have time, so I'm going to grab corner boost, and then I can maybe get a boom over. Get a 50-50. I'm going to grab my corner boost. That's most important. They have no angle here. So my teammate should be fine. Just going to keep trying to dodge demo. My teammate's taking it up the field quick. Amazing. And we're almost able to get a goal. Not quite. Able to hit it over one. Maybe this is awkward for him. And it's almost will lead to a goal. I'm going to get out so that my teammate can finally go. And just try to get back. And I think that's my fault there. I probably should have gone back to net. I was slow to rotate back. That's a nice shot. Let's see if we can get it back. Maybe we can get this back. Oh, would have been a goal. Not the best control from me. So that'll be game. Game three, we lose. So we go, I think we're down one and we will wrap up the episode there. So hopefully that was helpful. Washing off the rust, but uh, could definitely play better for sure. Chat, say bye YouTube and go tell them to click the video here and watch the next one, right? Chat, tell them to click, click the thing. Click, click that. Click the, whatever, wherever the video is. <laughs> Amazing.